Hi, my name is Margaret Woldridge. I'm a professor from the University of Michigan, and I'm here today at the Canadian meeting of the Combustion Institute. Today, we've been discussing all sorts of fuel properties, and we've, in particular, we've been discussing quite a bit about the future of ethanol. Ethanol has, I think, a very bright future ahead of it, in particular because of the intrinsic properties of the fuel. It's very attractive in terms of its ability to reduce soot emissions and to improve the efficiency and performance of internal combustion engines. The researchers that are here today are doing a lot of work in trying to understand and optimize the combustion performance of ethanol. Automakers have been very responsive and there's been a lot of work in the area on trying to emphasize how we can use ethanol successfully in passenger vehicles. We've seen a huge growth in the ethanol production in the United States and abroad. There's been millions of vehicles put on the road that are called flexible fuel vehicles that can operate anywhere from 100% gasoline to 85% by volume ethanol with a balance of gasoline. So we've made a lot of progress, we've learned a lot, we still have a lot of challenges ahead of us, but it looks like we can do some very good things with ethanol as a significant fraction of the transportation fueling sector.